Finally! It's the XJR-15! Rápido y raro, and a long way from its native habitat in the UK. I wonder how it got here. GMC Jimmy, muy bien. I mean, Theo Oscar said he was a Chevy Blazer, but that's only because he thought it sounded better. I'll go in some transport. is a 7 liter 425 brake horsepower hemi engine and the scraps of a dodge dart let's get it back to the garage i do me Wonder those American collectors wanted this. It's a Viper. The ACR, I think. Aye, eight liter V10. And almost impossible to keep the power on the road. I can't believe it! Help me get it out of here. They found one of these things in Texas a few years back, but and I had no idea there was another. That is a 250 GTO. We've hit the jack. is a piece of history. It's a Corvette, very early, might be Definitely a classic camioneta, Ford F100. Let's take you back. It's a Mustang. Oh, talk about famous cars. This is the one from, uh, what's that movie with the detective? Uh, hang on, it'll come to me.
see. BMW. Too old to be made in Mexico, though. We should take it to the taller so I can get a better look. to be in muy mala condición. You think I can get it working? <laughs> that was a trick question. I can get anything working. Quarter of the field made it to the finish line in Mexico City, but five out of the top ten were these things. That's how I got the name. It's a Renault Cottrell. That makes sense. In the 60s, there was a ban on imports, so the government allowed them to be built here. Gracias for finding it. Look at that. Looks like an old Baja truck. Oh, this thing's won more off-road races than you or I have had hot dinners. <laughs> 